Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can take a screenshot with the Xiaomi Mi 10T and Mi 10T Pro. Okay, for that we will have uh, three ways for Let me show you the first one. It works with the buttons, with the power button and the volume down button. If you press now these both buttons for the same time together, just for short for one second, you will have a screenshot as you can see here with the preview one more time, the power button and the volume down button just for short together and you will have a screenshot. If you tap now here on the preview, you're able also to edit this screenshot uh, maybe like just cropping a part of it, maybe here the Google bar, just an example here, no? or a picture from a website or something like this. And uh, yeah, after you can save it directly here, or you can also share it directly um, to one of your WhatsApp contacts or messenger contacts and so on. So just go here and save, and it's part of the gallery. So the edited part now, of course. So there are two other ways to take a screenshot, but you have to enable them first, but they are very nice. So let me show you them uh, first. Um, so one of them is with three fingers, just slide them down across the screen and you will have a screenshot. One more time, slide three fingers down the screen and you will have a screenshot. But as I said, you have to enable this first. I will show you it after um, in the next step. Uh, and there's another way also to take a screenshot. While well, the user knows what I mean with this gesture, just double knock the screen and you will have a screenshot as well. Also, this feature you have to enable first. If you just double knock on the screen without enabling um, the screenshot tool, you will open the Google Assistant. So don't wonder if the Google Assistant opens now if you haven't it enabled. Okay, let me show you how you can enable this stuff for the screenshot. So just scroll down here, then go you to the symbol for the settings. So then scroll down to the point additional settings. And here we will need the gesture shortcuts. So and here we will have the point take a screenshot. So here you will find all the ways you can take a screenshot. And basically just the one in the middle. So the first point I've shown you uh, with the volume down button and the power button is enabled. And if you want to have the three fingers uh, slide down, just enable the first point and with the knuckle, uh, the third point, if you want to have it. If not, if you double knock, you can open a Google Assistant. Okay, so let's go back because I want to show you where you can find your screenshots and uh, captures and so on. Here, of course, at the gallery. Um, and in the first category, you cannot see your screenshots, by the way. But if you go here on Albums, you have an old folder just with your screenshots. Yeah, I hope I could help you with this uh, video and answer your question. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me something up. That would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for. And I've created also some other videos if you're interested in. Or maybe just subscribe me. It would be really a pleasure to see you again. And uh, yeah, maybe until next time. Ciao.